Where are your pants? Cow, where are your pants? He's gonna give us another chance here, Phil. That joker came right behind me. I heard his footsteps. That's what I, I, I think we heard him at the same time. I jerked over, but I looked at you, and then I seen him right on top of your head. Yeah, he wasn't 10 steps away. We got him, got him marked where he was at. <laughs> Might be hard to find. Uh, I don't have him marked real well, but I think I can find him. I keep calling a bit further than staying. We've actually been, we've probably messed up. We've stopped a few times and let out house from the truck, trying to locate coyotes. We know where to go and nothing's, nothing's answering. Uh, so now we just finally said, we'll just go ahead and make a stand. And sure enough, I mean, it's uh, it's just now five minutes and 43 seconds. That coyote had whipped in right in behind us. Had to come from where the truck's parked at. So and we just howled back that way just 10 minutes ago. 15 minutes ago, and they get a response. That's downwind too. The downwind come directly downwind. We come in the Coyote Pup 314. Switch to Pup 3 and actually give us another chance right there. I could have shot him, but Phil didn't have him, and then he took back off. Finally, switch things up a couple more times. I think he ended up hitting some more howls, and them howls got him stopped down there, and we center punched him. All right, well, we've got a coyote down out here. Now we've got to find it. Bad thing is the very last hand we shot one and we think after we got down there, it got up and run on us, but we couldn't find it. So this makes our third successful stand this morning, but we've only recovered one. So hopefully we cover our second one right here. Let's see what we got. We found our coyote walking up here. These things blend in so well out here and this, this sagebrush is taller than you think, but right here is where he was shot at. You can see a big old psh of blood. And right there he is. I think I pulled that shot back into his body a little more than I like. I like hitting him up on the shoulder. They usually don't run a bit then. Big old coyote for you. He is. Yeah. Somehow he hit better than I thought he was. Look at that. Yeah. Oh, it's a heavy Wyoming coyote. And that sucker was coming in hard. I mean hard. We heard him running in. I thought it was an antelope running towards us. Them big old teeth on that thing. Big old cow. No, I look here. Bring it right up here, boo. I thought it felt like when I was breaking the shot over that I pulled it back in here, but now I'd hit where I was wanting to hit him. Just usually I like to hit him on up in the shoulder, but that's just right directly behind the shoulder. I don't know why he run a little bit, but he did. He didn't run far, 20 yards, but damn, coyote down. Look here. Two-pointer. Two-pointer, baby. It's first one of the year for a two-pointer. Awesome. Well, it's been a pretty daggone good morning. This makes our fourth stand, and we have called coyotes up on three of the four stands. Last stand we was on, had a coyote come in from a long ways off. It was a really good stand. Put a shot in him out there about 250 yards, 260 yards or so. 
and he went right down, but we got up there over the bank and he was he vanished. He's gone. Don't know what happened, but we got right here on this stand, let out a few sore house, nothing responded to it. <clears throat> Waited about two minutes and went into Coyote Pup 314. It wasn't no time we heard a racket in behind us that I thought was an antelope running by. Looked over right over top of field, and here come this big old male Wyoming coyote charging in, I mean hard. Of course, he seen us jerking around and flared off to the side, but he gave us another chance. We switched hands a couple times, slowed him up with uh, uh, Pup Distress number three, and actually stopped one time for us, but still couldn't get on him. Took off running again. I switched to some howls. A lot of times you can get these run, you know, retreating coyotes to stop for a look with some howls. Hit female sore howls, it howled two or three times. Got him to check up, put a shot in him. Coyote down. Thanks for joining us on Tooth and Claw TV.